what else can we do to make our people happy? Um, healthcare, I can look and see if we can put in clinics yet. Housing, I'm doing something about. Jobs is good. Liberty is good. Religion. Okay, religion. That's always an important one. So can we put churches in? Yes, we can put churches in. And we can put a grocery in. I'm going to put a grocery in while I think about it. Um, and I'm going to put it next to... I'm going to put it... Yeah, over here. There. So... Um, all of these houses can go and get their groceries from, from over there. Or at least the, the, the guys in the tenements, these guys are growing their own, as I said. Church. This is one we definitely want to put in. And I'm going to put it up here next to the library, I think. Alrighty. Okay, well, that's just got a lot done. Um, I think we can afford to start taking some tasks. And... Uh, and then probably we'll crank it up and see how we do. Nope, another auto save. I'll probably edit that out. Uh, all right, let's. Um, well, hello there, old this. pal. America is all gloomy and doomy at the moment. I can't have that. If there's one thing I can't abide, it's mopery. Okay, so ten thousand fruit. Um, I guess this is good. We should do this. Um, we're only producing bananas at the moment which isn't going to really do the job I don't think so oh man um, another plantation how are we doing jobs wise let's just take a look do we have enough people we've got 20 open jobs and unemployed aye 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 huh. I'm thinking maybe we should convert one of our cocoa plants to um, pineapple or any of this one's kind of just about okay for pineapple although if we extended this road up this would be better to put in a pineapple one but I, I think we're going to have to do this for now so because we don't have the people otherwise so we'll put in some pineapples on this one yep okay change crop thank you very much Let's check on, um, oops, didn't mean to do that. Oh, I've got to let it change. Oh, yay, yay. Uh, I've noticed when you've got things on pause, like you often can't click on things. Like I, I had a problem deleting roads. I am and so it was because curious. I was trying to do while it was I paused. I can't believe what just happened. The rebels are attacking. Okay, that is massively bad news because I haven't built <laughs> my army bases and and I'm low on cash oh guys this this could be a little bit of a nightmare and I don't think I can't build during an attack uh, nightmare but it's a it's a rebel attack as opposed to like an invasion because that let's check the calendar. Which is going? Oh no, I can't check the calendar from there. All right, well let's see what happens with this rebel invasion. Let's speed this up because this is going to be okay. So here's the rebels. And, um, oh, oh, yeah, okay, we got rid of them. Okay, I'm going to slow this down again. Okay, we've got a little bit of cash. Oh, man, I'm going to build an army base before, <laughs> before I forget again. So let's put uh, the army base in. Let's spin him around, I think. Oh, do, you, do you want me to zoom in? Yeah, I thought you, I thought you would, because you want to have a look at the army base. Look! Quite cool, isn't it? Let's put pop him around this way, I think. Yeah. So we'll put the army base in there. They're quite expensive. Army base is thirteen thousand. And of course, we need people to uh, to occupy them as well. Oi, oi, oi. Um, 
Now, I converted this, didn't I, to pineapples? Yes, I did. Um, we can't afford to upgrade the effectiveness yet. Uh, can I put a manager in to help things out? Magnet, what's Magnet do? That's mining and build, uh, mining and... Ooh. We, we've got another inventor. We've just got 25 citizens, which is awesome. Foreman, okay, this improves the, the effectiveness and the job quality. That's exactly what we want, so I'm going to hire him in there. Invite foreign workers. Yep, we'll do that. And Our research team developing new materials was wondering why this steel girder kept getting bigger and bigger until it hit them. They will be missed. <laughs> That's quite clever. I like that. Steel mill unlocked. So we can build a steel mill when we've got some cash. I think we need to look at the trade. Rum. Export only. Look at that jewellery. 8,000. It's only a slight bump over the default price. So this, this is the thing. You, you look at these numbers. It's kind of not just how high the number is, but it's how much of a bump over the default price. Because, I mean, you can ship them out for 7,000 anyway. Right? So it's only like a, what, maybe a 15% bump in the, in the value of that. Um, so what can we export? We could export some uh, some meat, which is, that's not bad actually, but we need a 70 standing with the Allies. I need to build the embassy so we can um, check things out a bit better. Wool, tobacco, coffee, no cocoa of course, because we're producing tons of blooming cocoa. Uh, bauxite, which we're not digging up yet. Um, there's no iron which we are producing. We're not producing steel, but there's no nothing for steel anyway. Ah, yeah, yeah. We're not being lucky with the contracts, guys, and that's really hurting us. We need some good contracts. I guess I could look at putting some more ranches in and getting producing some more meat and doing a meat contract, something like that. Um. I guess, what's that? that's with the Allies, and that's going to be with the Allies as well. Oh, no. Need a 70 for that one. That one's a bit cheaper. It's still a decent contract, though. You know what? We've got three ships that are not doing anything. I'm going to take that one. Oh, look, it's the Mouldy Crow again. Our old friend. Okay, so we'll take that one. Um, I'm going to see about putting some pig farms in. Oh, freighter exported 12,000. That's good. Uh, let's have a look at the old ranches. And is there any place that's good for piggies? And the answer is, yeah. Piggies would flourish over here. So I'm going to put I'm going to put a piggy farm in there. And, um, can't squeeze one in there, but, oh, if I spin this round that way, yep. Uh, is there a better, better place maybe up here? Oh, yeah, piggies, piggies do very well up here. Mind you, the, the, probably anything would do well, well up here. I think that's a, a quite a nice fertile area. Anywhere better that I can put this? Worth a little bit of a look around before you just throw these things in, I guess. Nah, not really. Not really. You know, this is all quite yellow. This is fairly green. Can I squeeze this guy in if I spin it round that way? Um, not fantastic there, but... I, you know what? There. That's where I'm going to put it. Yeah, there we go. So we've got two piggy farms, so we should be starting to produce a, uh, some decent meat. Now that's, of course, if these get built. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put in an extra construction office. Uh, how are we doing for cash? Yeah, we're okay. A little bit in debt, but like not massively. I'm going to put it next to the Teamsters over here. There we go. Now hopefully that should help us 
get our construction going a bit faster. Now, we, we've had these tasks sitting here for ages, and you guys are probably screaming at me, going, for God's sake, pick up those tasks. General Penultimo has had yet another plot to delay our enemies. His Aha! Export 5,000 rum. ...has determined that we should get all of them drunk. That's a very good plan. Delay the invasion by 18 months. Well, that's no bad thing at all. The Ogre secured one? a deal for some top-of-the-line 3000 series tank designed by the best Italian engineers. This model looks promising, and I am sure it will prove superior to the other armoured vehicles in the field. Uh, Italian tanks. The only tanks with uh, one forward gear and five reverse. Oh, I've just upset all the Italians. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't mean it. Uh, export 5,000 logs and planks. Well, we've got loads of logs and planks. So that's not a problem. Whew. Okay. Um, our happiness is still not doing... Well, no, this is approval as opposed to happiness. Happiness is pretty good. Um... Yeah, I think it's because we need some more uh, military stuff. I can't afford to put in another army base at the moment. So, let's um, let's carry on. Um, I was trying to look in the calendar. It tells you over here. We've got like 72 months left. Oh, we've got a foreign worker, which is no, no bad thing. We're up to... Not in the labour force, 73. So we've got 220. Oh, two unemployed, six open, open jobs. Okay, so good. We've got a pretty good balance there. We've got 54 homeless, though. So I'm thinking we should do a little bit more on the housing front. But yeah, let's get the cash up a little bit first, shall we? Um, I'm going to quick build that. Because quick building that is going to make everything else build quicker which is no bad thing at all. We want to get these um, these farms up and running, get the meat being produced. Oh, look at that. Exported 22,000. That's more like it. Okay, now suddenly we've got some cash. Um, that just ticked up. That's good. I really want to get another army base in, like, ASAP, because I'm concerned about that kind of thing. And I'm going to put it there, I think. Yeah. Yep, that sounds good. Right. Okay, now that we've got to at least two army bases in, I feel a, a lot more secure about the whole thing. I think the next thing that we need to do is put in uh, a steel factory. We've, we've got these two guys producing iron. So the next thing is going to be steel. Now, let's have a little look over it. I should probably do a bit more exploring, shouldn't I? That wouldn't be a bad idea. Oh, look. This is like ancient ruins or something. Um, you know what? Let's send out the palace guard. Presidente, I'm shaking. You're shaking. Everyone is shaking. Oh, we've got an earthquake. Actually, I've got to say, considering that we're well into the third mission, we haven't had many um, disasters, have we? So, here we go with an earthquake. Oh, 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 everything's getting... Oh, we lost a lumber camp. The earthquake is over. We made it. Four citizens I killed. am now going to rethink my life and the choices I have made. Done. Now, let's evaluate the damage. Thank you for that. Um, four citizens killed, four buildings Hola, damaged, and two destroyed. Uh, an Iron Maid. Uh, 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 I was thinking Iron Maiden. But don't, I assure don't ask you, me why the that only collapsed roof we are responsible for is our own. Yes, okay, thank you, Mrs. Radio Announcer. Um, so, a logging camp got destroyed and a mine got destroyed. Right, let's get that stuff built again. Our cash has just suddenly jumped up to 232,000, which is damn good, because we need it so we can rebuild this stuff. Rebuild that. Um, oh, this... is... complaining. What? Oh, oh, no, that's, that's for this, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, no, yeah, that's it. Yeah, that needs to be repaired. We've got another task over there, but I want to get these things rebuilding. 
before kind of we do anything else. Uh, why aren't you... Oh, there we go. Rebuild that. 23 citizens just arrived, which is good news. I'm going to slide this down while I'm just searching for these buildings that need to be repaired. So house there. No, house. Zoom in a bit. I might be able to see a bit better. I think it's this one. Yes. Repair that. Uh, any more? Uh, there's... There's got to be, hasn't there? You know how blind I am when it comes to things like this. Uh, yeah, there you go. Look, there's another one. Yep, repair that. Any more guys? Scream at me. Come on. Let, send me a postcard or something. Let me know. I don't see any other little icons flashing around except for these. So let's take these tasks. The order has its contacts everywhere, Presidente. Leon Kane, our mentor, introduced me to some shady characters residing on Ilo Rojo that might just help our cause. If we provide the right incentives, that is. Okay, so... I have a confession to make. I just came out of a train wreck of a relationship. Things started off pretty nice, but then derailed so violently that it left nothing behind but an ugly, disfigured hulk. Just like some buildings I've been seeing on the island lately. Fix them already! Yes, all right. She's been a bit stroppy, isn't she? Now, what's what? Bum, 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 bum. So we can pay ten thousand, right? But what? I don't understand. Like, there's accept and there's pay ten thousand. Because, like, the objective is to pay ten thousand. So if I accept that, oh, what can I accept it and pay the ten thousand later? I, well, I guess that's what it's saying. Um, I suppose we should weaken the invasion. Because I, I have no idea how strong it's going to be. We've got plenty of cash at the moment, and it looks like our economy is recovering. So, we'll pay the 10000 Cool, done. Right, let's take the other one. Oh, no, look. We've got another repair there. Good. My research indicates that the U.S. will soon be introducing a prohibition. Okay, good. Have a rum distillery. Well, we've already built one. There it is. So, it's, um... Should give us a reward for that. Alright. Um, let's have a look at this. Is there an upgrade for this? Because you've said... Oh, yes. But you know what? We're producing a ton of sugar anyway. Um, oh, I've already done it. Oh, man. I've forgotten. Now, the good thing is that... Uh, look. 36,000. We're suddenly starting to produce like tons of stuff that's doing the... oh look tobacco, sugar, rum, planks, cocoa it's all starting to come together now exporting the fruit is coming along two army bases, one's built you know what, I'm gonna... ooh, I'm not gonna quit build the other one I mean I could afford to, I mean we've got 34,000 so I don't know, maybe, maybe I should quick build the other one. Um, but what I'm actually going to do, rather than quick build that one, I'm going to put another army base somewhere up here. And I'm not kind of like 100% sure of exactly where I'm going to put it. I'm, see, I'm thinking of putting it like there. Not only am I thinking about it, I've already done it. So let's extend this road up here good. Now I explored all over here but I haven't looked at what I'd explored so oh I've still got the roads on. What's this? Oh okay this is bauxite and for anybody that doesn't know bauxite is aluminium. Yes that's how we pronounce it in the UK. Aluminium not aluminium. Okay what's this thing over here? The, oh this is a uranium deposit. Okay and then we've got We've got an oil uh, deposit there, another oil deposit there. Can we put in... Uh, what do you put in for oil? You know, because I haven't done any oil yet. Oh, there's an oil well. Ah, not until the Cold War. So we can't do oil. But we have... Re we've exposed this coastline now. Um, let's have a little look around. Because sometimes when you... When, ah, see, look. We've got a uranium deposit there. 
and another one there. Hmm. Some people are protesting, unhappy with their life in Tropico. You know, I'm going to pause this while I'm looking around because um, we need to worry about that. But look, our approval rating is up to 50%, and I think that's because of that extra military. I think that's what's helped that. I say think, because I don't know. There's still a lot about this game that I'm still learning. Have we... Uh, we have uncovered that. That's a coal mine. Let's put that in. Let's put that in now, before I forget again. Okay, and let's hook that up with a road. Which is never a bad thing, so that people can actually get to work. Boom. I'm going to zoom in and just... Yep, that's gone green. I, t I see, guys. I am trying. I am trying to get better at these things. I, re I, I really do try. Uh, there's another coal one there. So you know what? We'll do. We'll do exactly the same thing again. So we'll put uh, iron mine, and then we'll hook up a road. Um, I think. We'll just kind of hook it up down to like here would be good. Let's put. It does annoy me kind of the sections that you have to put it in, but it is what it is. Um, okay, so we've got those two mines, so that's good. There's what's this up here? This is another bauxite. Now there's got to be some gold on this island somewhere. You know what? I'm going to send some troops from the palace uh, to explore, like, um, let's send them up to here, and then if I can possibly remember, I'll, I'll get them to explore, like, along this beach, and then they can wander back, and hopefully that'll explore expose most of that right let's um, spin this round again because I do like to stay with like one view and like if you guys have got any opinions about the camera views and stuff drop me a comment like like if I don't zoom in enough or like if you want to see like uh, you know sky do a lower angle because so we can see more or stuff just drop me a comment I'm, I'm happy to try and oblige all right I think we can um, now crank this up again uh, I am trying to keep this running as fast as I can but th this really is a fast paced game and to be honest you're probably better off playing on a slightly slower speed uh, like probably most of the time um, let's have a look because we got a bunch of people arrive we've got um, 235 employed no unemployed we've got 14 open jobs so that's kind of good. Hopefully we'll get some more people soon. But we've got 79 hope, ho hopeless. <laughs> Freudian slip there, guys. Homeless people. Hopeless people, more like. Idle. Bone idle. Unemployed. Unemployable. All right. We need to put some houses in. And we've got... Oh, my God. Look at the cash. 52,000. Okay. Well, our economy has suddenly picked up about time too. Let's put in some housing, and I'm going to put in, like, a decent amount of housing. Um, I'm just going to check. I, I want to have a quick look at the entertainment and see, like, how the entertainment's doing. Um, where's the happiness? Entertainment. See, entertainment's still very low from a happiness point of view. I think we need to do more. So, I'm going to put in um, a, another restaurant, which I'm going to put in there. Then I'm going to put in a, a whole bunch of housing. I'm going to put in another couple of um, tenements. I want to spin this around. All right, I, I heard you. Zoom in, Sky. Yes, all right. I'm going to put in a couple of um, tenement buildings. Right. Which way shall I put these? round yeah I'll put a tenement there and a tenement there so we've got like four tenement buildings now but I think we need to put in some more of these um, 
I don't know, either country houses or houses. Um, you know, I'm going to put some, some more country houses in. Because they feed themselves, which is probably no bad thing. So one, two, three, four. I uh, can't put that one there. Um, let me spin him around. And we'll see about where. I will bang a few more up here. This is the nice thing about like when your economy is running nice and strongly. You can just whack a whole bunch of stuff in. Now, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put a road like down here. And then, like, across here. Yeah. So that I can use this space that we've got in here. I'm going to put some houses, just some, like, regular houses, I think. These ones. Because it improves the quality for nearby houses. So, I don't think that's a bad idea at all. So let's bang in. Three, four, five... Let's bang in those. Let's bang another couple up here. And uh, pop one in here, I think, as well. Yep, that's not a bad thing. Now, do we want to put some any like anywhere else? Yep, yep. I'm going to put in some next to the palace. Four in there. I just spent that like fifty thousand. Boom! <laughs> All righty. Okay, but that should have solved our homeless problem. That's for darn certain.